peeps, thank you all for sticking with me for so long. This was one of the very few channels that started vlogging and doing something like this. Without you guys, like, my life wouldn't be what it is today. I wouldn't be put in these situations if you couldn't come out of it. I'm having a going away party tonight. There was nothing really like YouTube 10 years ago. <laughs> Smash the thumbs up button, it does help. I love you so much. Peace on the streets. Today is the first big day. I am starting to move things. The first thing that's going is my dresser. It's going to my cousin's house. I have a busy, busy day. I have storage bins. I'm gonna take stuff out of the drawers, store it. Oh my God, this is so sad. Freaking moon, Billy. I'm so funny, I just opened the drawer and I forgot I did this. This is my comforter set from the old house and I wanted to make sure I remembered that I washed this and it was clean and I even put like the lint dryer sheet so it stays smelling fresh. <laughs> I just found the Dope Fresh Nation shirts. We actually never even produced these. We were supposed to, they're so sick. Oh man, maybe I'll give them away to you guys. I don't have time to think about it right now, but I got two drawers out already. Hey Bamboo, get out of there. <laughs> And all my carts that I'm gonna need to carry all this stuff out. Well, just the dresser. I need to put the drawers on there. So I know my problem is going to be figuring out what to do with little things. Like, what am I gonna do with this random little pouch? Like, <laughs> And now I run into issues like this. I have all these random parts that I don't know what they're for. Is this from the dresser? Do I need to keep this? Oh God. <laughs> this is what I hate about moving. I don't know where to put this stuff. <laughs> Elevator to the loading dock. I did it! <laughs> wow, it looks so empty. It's right here. I have to push it out now. The drawers are on this cart, so I can just wheel that down. I'm multitasking while I'm waiting for my Uber to get here. I ran to my favorite coffee shop, and then I'm gonna get the Uber to the U-Haul, then I'm driving a big U-Haul truck by myself to get this furniture. Here I am at the U-Haul spot. Just got out of the Uber. About to just drive a giant truck. This is confusing. Nobody's in here. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Where, how do I get this truck? I already paid for it. Hello? Um, this is so weird. What do I do? Hi. I can't believe I'm about to drive this giant U-Haul truck. Take this thing out of the window. Oh, it's broken. That's great. <laughs> this just feels so funny. It's a huge truck. I asked the guy, I'm not used to this because I never drove a giant truck like this. You have to adjust the mirrors by yourself, which is going to be difficult because I'm not sitting in the driver's side. I can't not at least get a rake in my camera for, for this experience. Oh my God, <sighs> this feels so weird. Oh, I literally can't see. This truck is huge. Ah! <gasps> oh my God. Wow, wow, wow. They were right. It's not easy to drive this truck. <sighs> and you can't see. Oh my God. What does that mean? <sighs> I hope he's behind me. Oh my God, this is not good. Hey, cool. Okay, cool. So they don't know, I have no idea what I'm doing. Got this. I got this. Woo! This truck is huge. This is the, the 15 foot one. I definitely think I should have got the 10 foot one, but the guy was like, nope, you need the 15. <sighs> what am I doing with my life? My entire life is about to change. Oh my God. I cannot. 
cannot believe I'm losing myself. If you guys ever see someone driving a U-Haul truck, you should stay away from them. I, I think you should definitely stay away from them. Uh oh, beeping at me. Oh my God. Trying to move over. Don't be a dick, please don't do that to me. They didn't tell me there's a hand truck in the back of this truck and it's flying around back there. It keeps like making these loud noises and scaring me like I'm breaking stuff. Oh my God. I should have got the insurance. The cat tree's going. My cousin's mom is gonna take it and borrow it. I have the furniture all packed in right now, my dresser and those two cat trees. I have to drive really slow because there's so much space left in the back of the truck right now. I don't want my stuff to fly around. This is the new home of the cat tree. And this is Violet. Do you like it, Violet? It does take time to get used to stuff. <laughs> I dropped the cat tree off, now I'm at my cousin's. My dresser has to come out and her old dresser has to go out. We're donating a whole bunch of furniture to this woman from Africa who's in a church. That's what I'm doing. I'm taking all that furniture, I'm driving it to that woman and I'm gonna put it in her house. We're getting rid of this dresser and then my dresser's gonna go here. <laughs> couldn't fit the desk out of the door. She was gonna get a desk too, but we literally couldn't even fit it out. It has to be disassembled and we don't have time to do that. <laughs> We're taking apart a desk at my cousin's house to make space for my furniture. Careful, dad. Karate. Karate chop. <laughs> so she's getting a dresser, two nightstands, and a different dresser for her son. And we're heading over there right now. It's a long day. It smells like a cookout. Great. This is my cousin. She saved a popsicle for me every time I oh, do you remember the videos where I redid her house and we would eat popsicles every time? She saved one for me for all this. Thank you and thank you for letting me keep everything. Of course, here. you're the best. Jason's helping as well. This is Joy's boyfriend, soon to be fiance and husband, right? Um, sure. <laughs> I'm getting really comfortable driving this truck now. Not hard. I feel really confident in it. All done. It's all done. <laughs> Gotta fill this bad boy up. Yes, another U-hauler. It's another friend. <laughs>